Born in Hanover in 1931 Watson was a recipient of the Order of Jamaica. Barrington shared the Bank of Jamaica art collection in the mid-1970s and operated several art galleries, Gallery Barrington, which has existed in several incarnations since 1974, and the Contemporary Art Center, which was active from 1985 to 1998. His home in the parish of St. Thomas, Orange Park, is recognized as a heritage site. It is part of a former coffee plantation and it has, since he bought the property in 1968, served as the location of his main studio and a meeting place for artists and art lovers. Barrington left Orange Park to the nation in 1994. When Barrington Watson returned to Jamaica in 1961, the island was at a historical crossroads. With independence looming, there was a general optimism in the air and, as Watson remembers, the island literally went wild and he himself was determined to contribute to the development of his home country. He recalls, everybody was excited and ambitious and thought they found themselves. Against the background of these nationalist sentiments, Watson expanded the scope of his popular portrait and genre paintings to that of history paintings. In chronological order of the historic event, Watson's history paintings include, The English Landing, Date Unknown, The Morant Bay Rebellion, 1964, The Hanging of George William Gordon, 1968, as well as the contemporary history paintings Out of Many One People, 1962 and C. 1970, The Garden Party, 1976, and Michael and Fidel, 1977. In addition, he painted portraits of important political leaders and national heroes, Cud Joe, Date Unknown, Right Excellent Sam Sharp, 1976, Right Excellent Norman Manley, 1969, and Sir Alexander Bustamante, 1981. Contemporary history paintings often include portraits of recognizable people, locations and events of recent memory. All of these are ingredients of the Garden Party, 1976, Watson's largest easel painting that he describes as a celebration of the maturity of independence. It was commissioned by the Bank of Jamaica for the opening of their new building on Nether Soul Place and forms part of their collection of contemporary art that Watson